Welcome to another episode of Beers, Beards and Bushcraft. Today I'm um, decided to get out and just get some quiet time in the forest alone. I took out my favourite chair, the Filson Helinox collaboration, the sunset chair and the Filson camo colourway you see there on the left. I've got my trusty Hill People Gear Connor V2 backpack hanging up there against the Lavu. And <laughs> what can I say? The Nalgene Woodsman bottle. The wide one litre um, mouth. It's a, <laughs> it's a beast. <laughs> but it fits perfectly inside the, the pockets of the Connor V2. So that's why I bought it. So come here to me. I hope everybody's keeping great. Today I decided to come out with my Yervin bag. It's called the Yervin Hunter. It's an insulated poncho that can be used in other formats like a bivy or, or an A-frame tent. And I just wanted to, to show a couple of people what it's like on. It doesn't have a dedicated HUD system, but I'll show you what it's like with the HUD that they have. And that's really it. Let me know what you think. So right now, the weather is about 8 degrees Celsius, a little bit of drizzle, the ground is a little bit wet, it's a little bit cold to touch by the hand, but inside the Yervin bag I feel warm. It's, it's one of those systems that's used in Norway heavily by outdoors men and women, by their army, their special forces, they are selling the bag to other armies around the world and I just love camo I love the woodland camo they have they have one in a mountain camo that looks incredible I had a look on their Instagram page and people were posting up photos where I kind of had to look for a couple of minutes to actually find where they were in the photo the camouflage is that good and they sell other stuff as well but yeah I'm happy with it I used it all last winter uh, when I was bivy camping, it's really good because it's the primal often sighted. It helps to stop the ore value escaping from your sleeping pads. So as I was told by a buddy of mine who goes to the Arctic, he said, look, you have to make sure that you have a piece of material between um, the ground and your mats or it, the ground's going to suck all of the warmth from them so 
because of that, I got a Garvin bag. <laughs> I, I like to do photography. It's, it's a quiet enough bag to use for photography. Uh, it doesn't matter if the ground is is mucky, is wet, is cold. I can get down inside the Ervin bag completely inside it and do my photography or, or bivy camp. That's the great thing about a bag like this. So, listen, it's just a really small review of the Ervin bag, the Ervin Hunter bag. The rest is up to you guys. Go and have a look at their website, on their Instagram page and, and see what you think. And if there's... If there's any particular questions that you want to know, by all means, subscribe, like and comment, and I'll get back to you. I own this bag for two years now. I actually own two of them. And the great thing about it is you can sip the two of them together. Um, I have used them in a hammock formation, which is phenomenal. I've used them as the material for my tripod chair. It was really comfortable. There's no stretch in it. It's very rigid, no stretch whatsoever, but it was still comfortable, and the hammock was comfortable. So, yeah, for those of you that want, I have an Instagram page called Beers, Beards and Bushcraft, same as my YouTube channel. So go have a look and you'll see uh, some configurations that I've done with the bag. So that's all I can tell you for now. I'm going to go back to working on my Lavu, and look... I appreciate everybody, I appreciate everybody coming to watch my channel, to give me all the love, the support, the likes, the subscriptions, it means a lot to me, it, it really does, I, I am on the verge of going back potentially to the Republic of Ireland for work, uh, because I'm struggling to get work in the Czech Republic, so the support means a lot to me at this, at this time in my life, and when I go back to Ireland, there's going to be incredible adventures um to go on I, I just i really can't wait to get back and show you guys ireland so for now from me beers beards and bushcraft from my lavu behind i hope you've enjoyed us and yeah anything you want to know just just uh, write in the comments below thanks emil stay well and enjoy the rest of the day and the rest of the week thank you for watching